Hi, I'm Hank Vaden with Hank's Barbecue. Here we are at Memphis in May 2019 World Championship Barbecue Contest doing a hog prep. I'm going to show you a few things about the prep work of what we do to get the hog ready to go into for the World Championship Contest. So what we're going to do today at Memphis in May at the World Championship, which is a MIN contest, they're going to judge us on three criteria of the hog. This is a whole unit, you see it's cooking in upside down form, it's called belly up. What this does, it lets the skin act like a natural bowl, holding all the juices and the flavors of the things we do to the hog to keep the meats moist and tender. You've got three main proteins, your shoulder, your ham, and your loin, which is right under the rib cage. The challenge of doing this is the whole hog. You've got to cook all three of these proteins in the mass in one unit. So you can't take them out, can't separate them. Everything has to be spot on and cooked at one time. Some of the prep work, the things we do to get our pig ready in the belly up position. We're cooking up in Memphis and May. This is, like I said, the pinnacle of barbecue. Some people even call it the mecca of barbecue, the capital of where it all starts. And this being the pinnacle of it, the whole hog. And the, the level of competition is unreal. So what we're going to do to do that to sort of give us a heads up on maybe some of the other guys is the things we do. We're going to separate the rib side here, make some shorts. All this is going to pull up. Therefore, it's going to give me a access to get to my loin, which is down here. So what you want to do is just take a little, you don't need time to talk over the sauce. This is how we used to do it in the old days where you took a drywall saw and you actually did this, having them not punch holes in the skin. So if you punch a hole in the skin, you lose all your juice. It's kind of defeated the whole purpose of what we're trying to do here today. So what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna inject this hog. We're gonna inject every component of it. Simple injection, uh, you can make it at home. Salt, vinegar, water, sugar, nothing really makes to it. But you wanna hit all your components. And what we're gonna do is blow this hog up. You want to remember every time you do this, the more hole you poke in it, the more stuff can come out. I'm going to take this sausage and come right here. Take a skewer, and you're going to go in it. What we're doing is we're putting that on the outside of the loin, and it's kind of helping protect the top side of it. Plus, it put some flavor in there as well. I mean, the more flavor you do, well, that and protection of the loin too, because that liquid evaporates. A sausage is 75% fat and it'll help keep that loin moist. So this sausage is made for us in Oxford. It's a cinnamon brown sugar. Uh, kind of matches the flavor profile and apple that we do in our pig. So we just kind of do this to make it look a little prettier. A little less queasy. Alright, go to the back and get what you need and start rolling it up. But don't make it tight. What I want to do is two sides. Now I'm just putting in the main part of the shoulder muscle. And all this is going to do is tell me what the hog's doing when the smoker's closed, if I need to make any adjustments. But typically with these water cookers, you don't really have a whole lot of issues. But I just still like to know what this hog's doing on the inside. Because if it cooks, because no two hogs will cook the same time. Some may cook a little faster, some may cook a little slower. If it's cooking fast, I can slow it down. If it's cooking slow, I can speed it up. I don't want it to get over smoked. We're going to use a green fruit wood, high in sugar sap content. It gives you another level to your flavor profile, but at the same time, I don't want it to be black, I don't want it to be bitter, and I don't want it to be nasty. And all this foil is going to do is just kind of help protect it throughout the 22 hour cooking process. Now it's ready to go on the smoker.